Hello. Welcome to the dig stream two. Hey lemon. Remember to drink water. You know what? I'm gonna drink some water right now. Just for you. I have a cup of ice here. <coughs> Got some water. So back to some more Steam World Dig 2. It was definitely does seem like a I, I can see how people were saying this almost makes the first game obsolete. It's kind of the same concept as the first game, but it's bigger. It's better. But I think it is, I'm glad that I played the first one first because it is important to the deep lore. You know? Um, and... Okay, let's, uh... Let's get into this. The big dig, yes. The extras are contact and credits. Maybe you unlock something else there when you beat the game. Maybe we'll find out. Right, the lore of... Steam World Dig, exactly. The Deep Lore. Say it like Matt Pat would. Oh, I don't know. I don't know how he would say it. I don't really. I'm not super familiar. I can only do the J version. Uh. Alright, let's see here. I, I think I'm gonna save up for the new, next pickaxe because that's always good to have. IMO. So, uh. No, before I forget, because I know we're going over here and going down this way, before we go back there, I remember that there is a little secret to the right here. Maybe we can get that real quick. It's an artifact. Oh, I have a... I just remembered I have this now. This hook shot's pretty sick. I gotta say. It's gonna get me places quick. I'm far away. Gotta be an opening somewhere. Maybe right here. There's the present. Ah, here it is. Found the opening. La, shouldn't it be ooh la la? Anything could be inside this neatly wrapped package. Maybe a doll, a football, or nothing but a shape and variation in the structure of space. What's in the box? Got a movie reference there. Um, that's fitting because it's you know it's 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 the holiday time. Everyone probably their Christmas shopping right now and or other types of shopping. Uh, 
Imagine if I had found them, then I would have came out here and I would have been like, what for her? Go back this way to the teleporter because it looks like it'll be faster. Dive up, there's actually a teleporter right to the left over here. In the box, there could be a gun or a different gun or something else. <laughs> right. One of those specific... Okay, so I think this is where we left off. About... I've seen this before. Oh, you can grab it with your hookshot. I also hurt myself anyway. Zoink Sonium! Oh, jeez. Good thing I remembered how those worked from the first game. Actually, I should take these guys out because they give you a lot of XP. Blow up. Blow up. Goodbye. Thank you. I did not. I'm the winner. Well, don't exist no more. Donkey Kong Barrel, but evil. There, hey, there is an evil Donkey, Donkey Kong barrel. There's a boss fight in one of the old Donkey Kong countries with a giant barrel. Why don't you know it? Aw, oh, damn it. Right, it's only one space. Oh, you know what, though? If I drop this on them. Aha! No time with these guys. We're gonna level up in no time. No time at all. Big city. But you level it. I'm big How about you going the lava? Ah. You guys just don't know what hit him. Oh, the teleporter. Always. The hanging lava gardens. Stuff now that that's open, but uh, there's a little more treasure in the immediate vicinity. We can catch up real quick. There. Oh, actually, out of space. Dude, you could juggle them. What a thunk. Stream's kind of empty. Yeah, right now it is. Hopefully, some more people join in. I mean, it is uh, Saturday, so maybe people were out doing something, and maybe they'll get home any moment now. They'll tune in. We can only hope, Lemon. We can only hope. Hey, I might be able to afford the new pickaxe now.
Bonus 35%. Ooh. Pretty good. Hell yeah, I'm getting that tungsten pickaxe. Has just the right density and toughness for that premium digging experience. I like that in this game all of your upgrades just cost money, and the first game after a while they started to cost like those orbs that were sometimes kind of hard to find. And then it's the mods that are based on the cogs. Adds a chance of spawning extra healing orb from enemies. To onto that. Alright. Back. So how are you doing today, Lemon? Ow. Oak. This, this hook shot's actually really sick. Oh! Oh jeez, I'm almost dead. This I did not notice. Holy crap. I'm gonna have to teleport right back already to heal. Goodness gracious, how the heck did I manage to get myself into this mess? You doing just fine? I'm doing fine. I just finished my finals, so I'm, I'm just... I'm finally ready to just take a load off, you know? Goodness for that. There we go. I need to teleport back real quick and heal. Heal, heal, heal. Oh, you know what? There's that gem I never. I kind of pick up because I was full. Now I can. Uh oh. Hmm. Oh, jeez! You bet it didn't blow up the, uh, lava. Oh, I know what to do. Aha! Oh! Holy crap, I thought I was gonna die. This game has a few similarities with Majora's Mask. Mean Navi, Hookshot, the existence of a desert, frogs. Oh, I never thought about that before. You know, I haven't done a stream on Majora's Mask yet, but that's definitely one of those that I'll have to go through. It's been a long time since I played it. I, rem I remember that being the hardest Zelda game for me to figure out the first time I played it. It took me so long to figure out how to get to the first dungeon. It took me years to figure out. I would always restart the game and I'm like, okay, I don't know what to do now. And then finally when I figured it out, I found the rest of the dungeons just fine, it's just, for some reason, that first one... You know what, let's upgrade our health. I mean, if we got wrecked that quickly... Makes you acid and lava resistant for a short while. I don't... Have to find some more cogs. Most people have difficulties with the water dungeon. The, yeah, the dungeons... Um, yeah, I didn't have too much trouble with the dungeons. I think I had to actually restart the Goron dungeon one time because I went into it too late. I should have went in. I found it like too close to the final day, I guess, and I ran out of time the first time. That kind of sucked. Hell yeah, level up. But aside from that, um, it was just finding that first swamp dungeon. Was so difficult for me.
Kadoos. Uh oh. Like Zoinksonium scoops. Oh, nice. Got them both. There's the little cross pattern. Hey, double O. Can you dig it? Dig it, sucker. <laughs> Can you dig it? Suck. It's a good thing. What's your favorite wrestling theme, Double O? Holy crap. Oh man, I'm being dumb. I'm just trying to get in there to grab. Oh, gold, actual gold. John Michaels. <laughs> doom, 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 doom. Ah. It's such a, like a sus song, but for some reason it works for Shawn Michaels. I think I'm cute. I know I'm sexy. I got the looks. Five, six. But I got the moves that really move me. I sent chill up and down that spine. You know, the original version of that theme song, there was an, a, a girl singing it. It was, uh, ah, what was her name? I can't remember her name off the top of my head. But she was singing his theme song, and she was saying, like, he's so cute, he's sexy, like, and then after he turned heel, and he, like, turned on her, I believe is what happened, he, he came out singing his own theme song. What was her name? It's, like, right on the tip of my tongue. It has like, like, like scary in the title or something. Remember. Old, old wrestler. That's like from like, maybe the late 80s, early 90s. How's this going? Oh geez, can't. Oh jeez, oh jeez, I don't know what I'm doing. Oh jeez. And her name's- oh, the Sensational Sherry. That was her name, I believe. The Sensational... Sensational Sherry. I believe that that was her name. A suspicious song I like that isn't a wrestling theme song, and I'd be afraid of someone who would use it like that. The name of the song is, I quote, the penis eek. Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. That'd be weird if a wrestler had a theme song like that. I want to be honest. Where is these like cracks or crevices and let's see. Reach it, there we go.
Oh, now this is obviously a secret. I don't know, this secret's kind of... So let's see, this would just lead this way. Obviously we want to go to the secret path though, because we're going to get like an artifact or something. Hello, Katze Chainsaw. Pardon me? A very popular brand and one of many items in their series of Texas style accessories. Unchain someone else's heart. Hello, Katze Chainsaw. Is that a reference to like Hello Kitty? Gosh, I wish I could remember way I'm supposed to be going. I think it's this way. Ow. There's a dog. That was another artifact for a second. Oh my god. The explosion. Ouch. Oh my goodness. I need to stop landing in lava or I'm going to be in trouble. Lever's not gonna work until I power this gold. Another useless lever. Yep, yep. Yeah, yeah, I know. This brazier might do the trick. Brazier? That's not like any brazier I've ever seen. It's funny how you used to sell them to Dorothy, and now Dorothy is the one selling them. Temple bowels. You can light those things from the side, huh? Oh man, when there's three of these we need to turn on. Like... Uh-oh. Who dares stand before the great prophet of the destroyer? 
Yeah, I know this guy. He's the one that brought me to the other temple. Shining light, what are you doing with this unworthy bot in my temple? Where's Rusty? What have you done to him? As I have foretold, Rusty the Destroyer will bring the Great Quake and shed our moral coil. mortal coil. He granted us a doomsday device, then he left again, for his ways are mysterious. Then I must be- then I must disable that thing. Yeah, tell us where you've hidden the doomsday device so we can blow it up. Oh, Guiding Light, how you've fallen. I will not let you two ruin our precious apocalypse. Boss fight? I opened a, sh a video and it immediately said, do you want to buy a shirt to look sexy? <laughs> what the heck? Dude, we're in a boss fight. This is pretty epic. Ah! No, it's not epic anymore. I got hurt. Uh, need to open up pathways. Uh, he's doing it for me. Got him. I think the bomb still gets him even when he teleports. That's good. Woohoo! And I knocked him in lava. We wombo comboed him. Oh jeez, his fire blasts are getting a little crazy. There's this guy. Okay. Oh no! Got away before I could... Bomb hit. Jesus. I, I keep forgetting you can't shoot your uh, bomb while you're in the air. Getting too used to that with. Oh! My hook shot. There we go. Ah, you cannot stop the coming of the Great Quake. The Doomsday device is still secure. The end is nigh. Oh about that. Hey Shadow, welcome. We just beat a boss. Today's day 605 of Lemon. There's 225 days left to day 730, the two year anniversary. Oh. The Lemon Packs. Pasted in the wrong place. Oh, that's okay. I don't mind the lemon fact now and again. Wait, wait, you have a place where you paste lemon facts and I don't know about it? Ooh, level up, upgrade time. Ignition Axe. Okay, this is what I was thinking. I figured we were going to get some ability that had to do with fire. So, I guess now we have it. Yo, look at that. Summoning a lemon every day until you're famous, around 1k subs. Ah. Oh. Shawn Michaels was absolutely well-written character for TV. His girl song was absolutely super playboy. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, he was, a uh, definitely one of the best in-ring performers out there.
Oh, I see the puzzle. To activate him a second time and then hide in the hole. Ow. There we go. Yeah, him singing it. I mean, that's the uh, definitely the definitive version of the song is him singing it for sure. Flair's still going. Even at his old age. I guess we're done with this area. I don't see anything. Yep, yep, okay. I didn't find any secrets in there though. I definitely missed something in there. Hang on. Definitely missed a secret. Somewhere. You lost your soccer game today? That's okay. It happened. Sometimes you can learn more from losing than you can from winning. And I don't know where the secret is that I missed. Probably shouldn't have came back down here, <laughs> honestly. There's some secret in here, but the heck if I know where it is. Ah, the more you keep hitting it, the more you look just going. Let's Oh, oh, wait, I think I see it up here. You know what? I tried hitting a block that was up there. Nothing happened. I tried hitting it with a bomb. Maybe maybe the bomb doesn't work. You just need to get this guy over here. So I literally checked the right spot. I just didn't hit it with the right thing. Because watch. Try it with the bomb again just to see. Bomb doesn't work. So I guess you have to hit it with either your axe or with maybe your piston punch. There it is, okay. That's why. I had the right idea, but I didn't use the right tool. All right, I'm glad we found that. How would I hit that? I have to come back for that one. So we're trying to 
fill up all of these skulls with fire. Oh, now I can just hit them. No more puzzling needed anymore. <laughs> sure there will be, but... Save us some time. back yet. That's one big pool of molten minerals. This coal is really into this whole fire and doom stuff. I can't cross that thing without melting. Maybe if you just dip your foot in and see, it might not be that hot. I'd have to be fireproof. Or if you were as cool as me, you could just fly across it. Hmm. I'll have to come back this way. This must be the Doomsday device. I really didn't want to believe Rusty could do something like this. Seems to be a lot of Vectron parts in that thing. Let's smash it. Woo. That sounds like a good idea, just smashing a Doomsday device. Oh yeah, that sounds... Sounds safe. Oh, only took three hits. Hehe, <laughs> that was great. Yes, it looks pretty harmless now, doesn't it? There's Steambot and Vectron parts all jumbled together in this thing. Why would Rusty build something like this? You worry too much, less thinking, more smashing. You should head back to the Oasis and tell Rosie that the device is disabled. The Oasis? Doomsday is a character from Marvel. Uh, oh yeah. X-Men, the original mutant, right? <sighs> Ronald's treasure chamber, only operating acolytes of level six or higher may enter. That's me. It must be really secret. Okay, I see. This is the oasis. I'm gonna figure out what that. We managed to disable the thing that was causing the earthquakes. Excellent, you actually did it. Yeah, we did. Still no sign of Rusty though. If the thing you call Vectron changed him, maybe he's down there among its remains. The Doomsday device was partly made of Vectron technology. Oh no, I know what you're thinking. I don't want to go back there. You don't know what it's like in there. What if it's like to... What it's like to not have a will of your own. I've already come this far. I can't stop now. If, I, if you could show me the entrance, Fen. 
Why? Why can't we just go wreck stuff instead? He brought down Vectron. Rusty saved us. I'll get you there, but once you enter Vectron, you'll be on your own. Oh, that's deep. Okay. Keep keep away, you you gear can gear can. I'm not dangerous. I just wonder if stubby stub stub. Okay, I'm backing off. Because Rosie don't like me going into the mine to stab around. Sounds reasonable enough. But I like stabbing. Stabby Helen. No, I like to stab things. Uh, I don't say. We're gonna have to keep digging down. I don't know if I could go any farther down in this section. I think I have to go back to this area now. I think. Kinda hard to tell because I can't. Yeah, it looks like it's straight down from here. Ow. Pizza? Oh sure, who doesn't like pizza? Ah, secret area uncovered. See, it's light. There were some golems in the way. A certain point. Probably where we need to Oh, I'm fine. Wanna get nuts? Let's get nuts. My cat's name is Kevin. Good old Kevin. Where'd the bird go. Oh jeez. No! That's my first time dropping stuff. 
I guess you just lose some of it. You don't actually drop it. Oh, that sucks. I, I forgot that I had a hook shot. I need to utilize that. Yeah. Ugh, you have five different I one hour of silence interrupted by X videos playing. That's pretty brave of you. the ignition axe if you really want to. I don't know why you would. That'll help. I'm gonna get more armor because clearly I could use it. Like the first projectile that hits you. Heaven's a cool name. Thanks. I think so. Ah. You know what? I think I could get there faster from here, actually. So close to leveling up and healing too. That gosh, another plucking bird. suddenly getting these boat pickups. Getting pretty deep now. Tell you what. upgrade my piston on a little bit.
Ouch. It was a cactus trap. Yeah, we are going deep. Oh, there's a teleporter nearby. Good. Because we're almost full up on materials. The lamp's already been... I should upgrade my piston. Yeah, let's do it. The Ivan Drago Mark IV, what the heck? The has been reinforced with tungsten carbine for that. I must break you, power. I must break. It's lower wind down, which Jack Timer revved up one. Sorry, I needed that. I, I don't have enough money for the lamp, lamp now. I needed to get the uh, that piston punch power so I can dig through those heavy rocks faster. this. No doubt about it. It goes so much faster. that heals us is like really putting in work. Yeah, we are getting big money.
Oh, look, we're already like out of space. I have to go teleport out again. I'll upgrade my bag too because now our bags are going to fill up really fast again. Then we won't have to stop and go back some. After I update the bag, then I'll update the lamp. We haven't really needed it though. Our lamp's been pretty cool. We keep getting light from the enemies, but we'll still drive enough. Open tote. One bag to hold them all. Alright, I can afford it, I guess. Exposed resources. All right. Next, I'm gonna want to save up for the uh, for the next pickaxe, probably. Here's a life hack. If you hook shot down, then you won't take fall damage. I want to see kills up there, though. These guys, they, they don't stand a chance. I think we led right back to all that other materials we kind of fit last time. <laughs>
crap. It was a big old drop. Good thing there's a teleporter over here. Bottom of the mine. Made it to the bottom. Adds up the bottom. Pickaxe cost 700. Hopefully, next time we'll have enough. No water. Death ahead. Oh, my goodness. What do you mean, death ahead? I like the sound of that. A secret. Oh no! Rumble. I wonder if there's more secrets. Oh! I bet you there's some up there. We gotta get it. Whatever it is, they're hiding from us. No, it's, it's, uh, icky. There we go. Figured it out. Oh, here we go. Here we go. There we go. Oh, wait, this is where I came down from. The secret. <laughs> The secret was just the entrance. Oops. There's something up there too though. Are they hiding from this way? Aha! Oh, that's where we were supposed to go. Pay my taxes? This is an exit, I think. Hmm. We gotta go this way then. Taxes. What kind of tax? Secret. A British accent. Accent. A British. T tax. Probably have to come in through the other way. Yeah, but now I know that's up there. The lemon tax. No. 
hang on a second. Where their lemon packs it. I don't recall there being. Oh gosh darn lemon packs. Heck is that? A torture device. This is it, the entrance to Vectron. Alright, let's enter that thing. I told you, I'm not going in there with you. I don't want to. Even if I did, I wouldn't be able to not through a portal like that. But I said I would get you. If there's a chance that Rusty's in there, I have to go. What is this, virtual reality? Then you must go, I guess. This looks kind of sketchy, I don't know. Just like Travis strikes again. There's a lemon tax now. It was just invented. You'll be alone in there and you won't have access to my map. You'll have to find your own way out. Are you really sure you want to do this? Is this like the is this like the final part of the game? Are we already there? There's no way, right? Give me a sec. Yeah, I'm not gonna twist your arm. Hmm. Alright, I guess we have no choice. We just gotta go in there. Okay, here it goes. I'll come find you when I'm out again. See anything moving in there just run run as fast as you can uh that's a little ominous um holy crap oh we don't have a map or anything this is scary ow This is weird. Can we trigger these golems? do they have in here? Cryptium? What the heck? can't believe we just picked up cryptocurrency. What's up with that? We're in the Matrix? You're right, this does kind of seem like not the Matrix, it feels like the real world you wake up from, from the Matrix. Uh... Oh! Holy crap, evil. Oh, they explode and give me extra free stuff, cool. You guys aren't so bad after all. Oh jeez. Holy crap. Holy crap, we took a lot of damage from that fall. Imagine if we didn't have any health. Uh -oh. Giant robots in the background. Are these like the titans of the robot people? Here. 
How is it lightning down here? How the heck you have lightning in a cave? I don't know about this. I don't know about this one. Oh, they go into the computer monitors and explode. Sometimes. Sometimes they just try to blow you up directly. Oh, jeez. different game. Oh! Oh, jeez. Uh... Surge boot, initiate threat analysis. Moon escape. Okay. stacking before they put in another world. Oh no, it's gonna go inside of the robot, isn't it? What do I think about Matthew Path? Who the heck is Matthew? Is that a secret character? There we go. Oh, there's nothing up here. It was all for nothing. Oh, jeez. Holy crap. Oh, jeez. The bomb just missed it completely. Holy crap. It's gonna kill me. What the heck? Okay, at least it checkpointed me. Alright. I didn't know that was gonna happen. I guess we just run forward past it. Ah, oh, didn't. How does it jump so high? That's insane. Crap. These guys aren't exploding. Good though, so I could get. That was crazy. Do I plan to play Grand Theft Auto the 6th? Uh, maybe. If I can run it, or if it's available for a console I have. Oh boy, more. I get the feeling we don't want to trigger these. We can help it. I'm surprised that Fen wouldn't like being in here considering it is one of the energy things so it could just go inside of a you know it I don't feel like it's in any danger here
If you have PC, it's not gonna work. You have to wait in a year. Funny, I have Grand Theft Auto V on Ep- I think I got it for free on Epic a while back and I still haven't played that. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Oh no, this ain't good. Oh no. Holy crap. Bad. I need to dig down. Oh jeez, wrong way. Holy crap. Oh jeez. Oh, no, no, no! I made a mistake. I made an awful, terrible mistake. Oh jeez. Holy crap, another one? Disaster Protocol Blue Savior Initiative initiated. Saving game. Oh, we woke up here. I guess it was all a dream. Mysterious game. Oh, another upgrade. We, this makes you immune to evil robots. Jet engine. What? No way. That's wild. Now we can go to that secret area easy. That's crazy. It doesn't even cost steam energy or anything. I don't know how I got out exactly, but I told you I'd be back. I was alone again, stuck. I must have dozed off. I dreamt of something, something I wanted to tell you about. It had to do with the quakes, the flow of power, and Dorothy. What, Fen, what did you see? I saw, no, I felt the presence of more doomsday devices. Come on, we have to tell Rosie. We're not rid of these earthquakes yet. Let's go back in. So awesome. I wonder if we could fly through this. Right here, I think, would be the secret area that we couldn't reach before. Face plushie. Sleepy time kitty plushie. Hmm, the choking hazard warning seems to be written in Sumerian, Egyptian, Akkadian, and a bunch of other ancient languages. Since I'm here, might as well drop this stuff off. I can afford the new pickaxe. 
Vámonos. Allows you to hit projectiles in mid-air to flip their direction. What? That's cool. Oh, this is new. Oh, the flying one. When the jet engine reads, keep holding X to reduce your fall speed. Oh, like float. That's. Ah, we'll have to up upgrade the jet engine next chance we get too. That's a really sick power up. Have I seen the amazing digital circus? Oh yeah. I saw that right when it came out, it was really good. I actually posted that in my Discord. Uh, I thought it was pretty good. Alright, so we need to go toward the Look at all these secret areas we're gonna find now. Six pack of moon juice. A shiner's wet dream. Two things are for sure. They sure are crazy for it, but they'd also surely be cattywampus without it. Surely dirty. Better than the stuff it looks like. Ow. I didn't mean to fall. Maybe if I jump into the green stuff, it'll make me strong like Rosie, but she doesn't touch the stuff. Like, well, probably not a good idea then. I know Murder Drones is from the same uh, publisher or studio, whatever you call it, but it's, I know it's not, this, the creator of Digital Circus didn't make Murder Drones though, I don't think. But I know they did a uh, uh, goose works, but I know they did other animations, uh, which are some pretty good ones. Like their run mo is a really good animation. You're back. Yes, I didn't find any trace of Rusty though, but we did find out that there are more doomsday devices out there. Of course, he's too smart to put all his eggs in one basket. This just won't do. You have to find all of them. None of us are safe until you do. Dorothy, I already know where they are. Uh, it, it, I felt it so clearly, the power flowing to them. One is in the temple you found me in. Second one is in the weird underground jungle we passed on the way down here. Lastly, there's another one inside the eastern temple. Alright, let's go break those devices. The mines are huge, with lots of secrets and dangers. Might be the straight path isn't the best. Jet engine I found will make it easier for us to explore. Yeah, we could go all over this place, digging up secrets and gearing up for destruction. Come on, let's go. Okay, there's one there. Wow, there's one really deep down. There's one pretty far to the east. Oof. He's... Wow. This one would be the easiest to do first, it looks like. We'll have to. I don't think I have any teleporters in there, unfortunately. So let's see here. Hey, I leveled up. Nice. I don't have any teleporters in that top left area for some reason. How the heck do I even get in there? Oh, this is where we came from, it looks like. Like way at the start of the game. I guess we'll go visit that one first.
water. Land right on the cactus. Oh yeah. Would you look at that? We found ourselves a cog. Yeah, I wonder if we can go to Tumbleton. Whoa. Zebulon Yonker? Hey there, oh, I honestly thought nobody would ever find me. Uh, that I'm, not that I'm lost or anything, but it was pretty harsh getting here, you know? Feels like I should have given you a little something for your trouble. I have this here blueprint. Keep in mind that enabling this one can make your journey more difficult. You should only use it if you want a bit more of a challenge. Death explosions? What the heck? Another secret area uncovered. Dead end. Hmm. I guess you. Temple of Guidance. Is a hot dog a sandwich? Uh, nah, I wouldn't say so. Ah, here we go. There we go. It's out of this in the right direction, I think. Yep. Yeah, they wanted you to make sure you had the jetpack before you came to the okay. That's for show. I never thought I'd be coming back to this temple again. This place is a lot bigger than just the part up there. I just hung out on the totem, so I never got to enter this area. It could be filled with deadly traps and cool things like that. We have so much mobility now, it's actually crazy. Where we want to get into. Looks like we're gonna have to go in from the bottom. Adds up the bottom. Eternium?
That is breakable. I just didn't go all the way. Alright, maybe the switch is in this cave. The switch is in this here cave. Look at that. I need this over to the left first. Oh, I can't. Oh, I can't. Left. Okay. There's more. Oh, wait. Ah, I see, and then I another one. That makes sense. <laughs> this first. Yeah. Okay. Oh, now I could do the one to the left first. Get that secret. Oh, get that. oh, I need a second one as well. Many southbound small town bots defied their fears. Most of these big city dreams of fortune and glory ended up unfulfilled, buried beneath the burning of the west. Of the way of the pioneer is always wrong. Well, now I need to destroy the. Or do I? Oh, no, that works. Wait, is this a cave within a cave? What the heck? Oh, I see. Okay, but there's still another one. 
at all. I did something. Okay, I was like stuck in the corner for a second. The thing it unstuck. Oh jeez. these walls. Oh, it was a trap. Holy crap. Oh no. It was a trap. Crap. There's gotta be a secret in here though that we can hit. An orange block, like within a bunch of Oh, 
Oh well, I don't know how to get it. I guess. It's not checked off either, so there definitely was a secret in there. I just don't know how to get it. I guess there's gonna be another doomsday device. Oh, there it is. Three hits. That actually felt oddly satisfying. Now we're talking. Feel that fan? Maybe, I don't know. Felt like a tremor. Go and trash the other devices. What if these devices are like keeping the doomsday from happening and destroying them? That'd be pretty messed up. Messed. Chamber of Secrets? What's up? Seems like it's pretty slow tonight. Well, hopefully I don't finish the game or else they're gonna miss out on the final boss. And then they'll be sorry. We, oh, don't, don't tell me we missed the final boss. I'll say, it's sad, but it's true. 
robot in water. Well, that's simple. It's it, it is a waterproof robot. like waterproof bones. Is it gonna let me like stop time or something? I wonder how it's gonna let me utilize that switch. I assume that's. Grenade launcher? What? What on earth? Pretty big explosion radius. Yeah, boom! Illusory wall ahead. Oh, what the heck? What is this? Dark Soul? I wonder if I can knock these back. Oh, I can, look, because I have that special ability. Unold, unopened invitations. Hopes and dreams conceived, chronicled, and left to decay in the arms of oblivion. Let it un. I know what to do here. Can this trigger it somehow? Oh, ow, it hurt me though. Need water. SpongeBob, because I need water. Damn. I wonder what the the heck this bird is to.
Maybe this is something I gotta come back to later. It's weird because it's just hiding a mineral clump. It's not even like it's an artifact. Yeah, I tried using the bomb to trigger the lever, but it didn't work. I'll try it again. I just... Yeah, no, it doesn't work. Yeah, it's a very suspiciously placed mineral clump, but I don't know how the heck to get in there. Because if I pull the lever, that goes down. That doesn't do good. Unless it's... Maybe it's for some, like, ability I don't have yet? All I can think of. Because the fact that it's instant like that just seems impossible. I don't want to say it's impossible, but it sure seems like it's impossible. Is there another lever? There are four other levers. But they're for another puzzle. Is there another lever, lever that controls the same door? I have no idea. But over here, there's four levers that do a different... I'm my way back. I went a way that I can't go to get back to it. I thought it would save me a little time, but it just ends up wasting my time. If I'd like do this so that they're all down here, I go back. That will have triggered them. How would I know which one? You know what I mean? Trial and error, maybe? I mean, I don't know. Well, yeah, I don't know. It feels like these are unrelated. But the counter, they sure seem awfully unrelated. I don't 
don't know what like pattern I would want them. Like I, I already had it on map because yeah, I don't know. Ah. Oh well. If it's really just oh one of them overlapped with the other one, that just seems kind of. I don't know, that just seems kind of lazy. Like, that's the puzzle. Like, you have to. You have to just. Check every single one to see if any of them link. It can't be that. If it's that, I'm disappointed. It's gotta be something else. I just don't know what it is. And you can't even go to see, like, if one moves from here because then you can't leave. Can't like look at the map. Oh well. And it's weird because it's it's like a mineral in there. It's not even like an artifact that they're hiding. So it seems like something that should be simple. And I just I don't understand what I'm what it is. Because usually if it's something well hidden, it's an artifact. I think it's called the, the literally like the cave of, of secrets or something. Of course. Exit and re enter. Chamber of Secrets, like Harry Potter. <laughs> I think I would have remembered that. That's what it is, you literally just do it until it breaks. Secret wall in here? trying to use the thing you told me about where you look at the walls to tell you if there's an opening for secrets. I thought it didn't show anything there. Just for, just for that. Wow. Yeah, it literally didn't even lead to an artifact. It was just 50 bucks, which I mean is good, but like... I don't think it was intended to be as tricky as I was making it. I was just being dumb. Also, this up here, there's a, a wall I could hit, but I can't hit. I did the doomsday device that's around this area, so I should just go to where the next one is. 
I just wanted to go in that cave first. There's also a secret over here I missed, maybe. I'll check real quick. Since you're here, maybe we'll be able to find it this Check every corner with my hip spot. Well, actually, there's an orange block inside of a wall, so I figured that's where it had to be. Oh, I think I know where it is. I think it just clicked in my head. I think I know how to get in there. See how there's an orange block in there, mysteriously? I think I know what it is. It was gonna be behind the darts, honestly. It wasn't. But that's gotta be it, right? It's gotta be in there. I just don't know the point. It has to be one of the surrounding pods. I was trying like all my tools and stuff because I guess I forgot that you can cook that deck. Like you could get there right before the exit. Look down to the left of the block I know. Oh my god. Yeah, there's an orange block right there. How did I not notice that? Okay, I, well, I need to get down there now. You come this way to get up here. So why would the why would that be the exit? Oh, cause I went in through the I went in backwards because I forgot. This is like the one area where the caves have two entrances. That would explain that. I actually that is the entrance actually. I came in through the exit. I did, I did do this. It's just minerals. Yeah, I already did this. That just reappeared. Yeah, I did do that already. So. But it could be down around here, like some secret. Uh, I don't know, because I checked the right side, I checked the top, I checked the right, it literally seems like just none of the areas of where you could get to that orange spot is open. I've checked all around. Underneath the big pile of dirt. I checked that too. I remember specifically checking that. I don't know if I could go back now plugging it down. Not that it matters when you're in a cave, but
I don't know why I'm checking spots that possibly. Back to the other entrance again. But yeah, I don't know. I, I was, I just could not figure out how to get in there. It looks like every way around that spot, it almost like, it almost feels like it's brick. I checked all these. I remember that. Not that that would leak down there. Check under the big pile of dirt again, even though I know I already checked there. Yeah, no. I even was doing this before I realized how you could just check with this. I was actually using all of my tools. It's a freaking mystery. Maybe it's a trick. Maybe it's an impossible to get. I really don't know. I thought for sure it would be... Hang on. I have one more thing I might not have checked. Really. Yeah, okay, there it is. Of course. Toy rocket. It was all worth it for the toy rocket. Follow the moon rivers with a huckleberry friend. Who knows what's waiting around the bend? Okay. What's the name of that girl from uh, Killer is Dead? Best name you could ever give a character. <laughs> All right, let's get the heck out of here. All right, so we took out one of the. Well, actually, technically, it was the second Doomsday device, but we got three more to go after. We just took out one, so now there's two other ones. It feels like we're almost getting towards the end already. Now, show me what you found. Here go. Here you go, fucko. Oh, I bet you the, uh, yeah, artifact guy's ready. On 18. Jeez. More porters. Reveals all resources on the mini map. Wow. Enemies explode upon dying. Oh, that's the one I got from that one guy. Um, activating this cog mod will make your quest much harder. It's just a challenge. To... Holy crap, I actually have five cogs ready to go right now. Before I, I use any of them. I can actually get more armor since I did die. Being resistant to acid lava, that could help. Deflects the first projectile that hits you, that could be nice. Just the three devices and then a final gauntlet. Alright, then we'll probably finish it tonight. It's too bad we don't have as many people as we did. 
but it is what it is. Um, Welcome back, Shadow. I'm gonna get this armor. The Doom armor we just got. That didn't unlock. Um. Adds a chance to get through. Pulls ex exposed resources towards you. Um. I'm going to. You know, first projectile that hits you, that's actually just automatically really good. I'm probably going to get the hit by projectiles. I'll just turn on a couple cheap. Everyone likes the maps. All right, so the next one is like it's down this way. It's it's beneath the bottom of the mine, of course. So hopefully. It actually be... Oh! Right, we never went this way. Because death ahead. Soccer or football, which way do you pronounce it? I mean... Since I'm in the U... Wait, oh, it's soccer, yeah. Since I'm in the US, they would say soccer, but uh... I know most of the world calls it football. Warning, do not enter. Uh -oh. oh geez, it really is death, holy crap. I was like, no way, is that actually spike stem? Yes. Well, good thing we didn't go this way before we got the jetpack. That would have been pretty bad. Holy crap. I was just trying to go there to get... Build them. Yeah, well, you know, that's just me sometimes. Sometimes I'm a rebel. Can't help myself. Well, I think upgrading my health was a good idea. Man, good thing this if this was like Celeste or something, this would all be insta-kills. We'd have to do this all without dying. <laughs> Which I'm fine with when it's that type of game, but... That's not what we're... Not what we've gotten ourselves in. Not what we've signed up for, I should. That's how to get back out. Yep. Oh no, this didn't keep going down. Hmm. So. How do I keep going? How do I get down there? This is as far down as this goes. So it's gotta be... A blue, maybe? Maybe I gotta go back to the... The path to Yarrow I took. Yeah, what, what's Yarrow again? Is that Yarrow the green? Or the red? Well, this is clearly going to lead to this other one. I don't know what Yarrow is. I mean, the name sounds familiar, but I don't remember what that is. Blue. 
blue mushrooms on? This one? Glittering row? I don't see anything called Yarrow. I'm, I, I assume you mean the glittering row, duh. Yeah, you must. There it is. It says Yara right on it. I don't know why it doesn't. zone yeah but i wish there was a way to see what it was like on here if it said like in big text like around it somewhere yarrow or like inside of it you know what i mean like on a map let's see if these snails are still in the butt probably not i'm probably way too powerful I think I've been in this cave before, but I just didn't get all the secrets, it looks like. But that's fine, screw it. Ooh, 150 XP. They give you more than those, those other guys. The cultists give you like 100, I think. You're more powerful, Shadow. You're more powerful than the snails. Okay, they are still kind of a... Who would win in a, in a fight? You, uh, the prep time, or the snails with morals off? Very, very important question. Oh, hell yeah. Gotta say, I'm impressed. I just came back to refill my health, really, but I might as well drop that off. Oh, okay. And we got a, a ways to go up here. I'm gonna try to get. How did you make it all the way down here? I'm sorry, but my pipes burglar. Okay, but it's really not really safe down here. You should go find a better place to hang around. All right, all right. They they came in through the pipes. Okay. That's one of uh. What's her name? Susan. One of her crew, whatever her name is. Ouch. Okay. He sung his way down. My pipes were so powerful, I sung my way down. Did I ever put on that acid resistance? I should have at this point. I didn't realize this was... That we we're gonna go to acid town right after. I don't think I did, but actually now I have some extra cogs. I could... I could have took off some of those deep ones that I just threw on to throw on, and I could put it on now. Oh! And I was just about to say, as soon as we find another one of these...
50% bonus, that's crazy. Berkeley's going mad with power with these tax increases. Ivan Drago Mark IV. That's like a double refi. Because we know Ivan Drago, the Rocky villain, but he's also in Rocky IV. Did you buy cogs from the trader guy? No, I haven't bought any cogs from him. I keep forgetting about that, honestly. But I have plenty, so it's not like I need any more. Like, there's nothing right now I specifically would want to use them for. I should either save it up for my jetpack, or... Uh, I mean, my bombs going even farther than they do could also be pretty useful. Next pickaxe is pretty expensive. I think I'm, I'm gonna... I don't know, maybe for my jetpack, I haven't upgraded that yet at all, because I got it pretty recently. Then again, the Ivan Drago is pretty... pretty tempting just by name alone. is full. The only time we really ever run out of lamp is if I'm like in a cave and I'm like there's some secret that I can't figure out so I'm just wasting a bunch of time in there. Otherwise you get been getting lamp refills pretty right there see we just maxed out lamp again. I'm just saying. What else? You know, I think it. I think we're pretty good on that. But anything else, jetpack, that would increase the amount of time I can jetpack. Pickaxe would make me dig faster. Piston arm puncher would make me punch hard rocks faster. I'm going, I'm just pro strats, you know? This, a little rock puzzle. Zoinconium. Like, I just invented it. I mean, discovered it. Don't forget about the mods, even if you don't have them unlocked, I think you can hover over to see what Yeah, that's true. I haven't really been using any of the ones that have been popping up. I've, I don't have any of these mods on, actually. Sometimes I turn this one on and off if I have an extra cog. Causes pickups a bit, Malite, don't really need that. Increases chance of automatically dodging falling rocks. I never get smashed by those, so that's not a problem. Chance of spawning extra light orbs. I already- okay, here's the thing. I have... Where is it? Um, core diversity that, that already 
I get rainbow orbs very often, which gives me a little bit of everything. So that's why a lot of these I don't really need that much. So, prevents your light from dropping below 50%, lets you see the weak parts of the walls when shining on them. You don't need no education and no thought control. Just look at the wall, what the heck? Then build too many walls and not enough proof. Pink Floyd reference out of nowhere. Heck, this place is still dark even with my lamp maxed up. If a wall is weak, though, like, can't you already see that, anyways? Like, what is it actually? What? It must mean something that I don't understand. Or actually, meaning. No dark suckers. Dude, come on. He's trying to hide a secret from me, I know it! Oh! He's just there to be a, a hazard. I thought there was. I thought he was hiding a secret. Yeah. For secrets and false walls? Maybe. Potentially. Uh oh. He died. Hell yeah! I leveled up. Perfect timing to level up. I needed that health. I sounded like a, a caveman who was freezing to death moments before discovering fire. <laughs> oh no, me die. Oh, me not die. Hell yeah. Second. I'm confused. Did I, I I just opened one of these, didn't I? But which one is it? Because none of them, neither of them have a question mark. Okay, I've been in there. Oh, it was just an entrance and exit? Oh, I see. But now this one's redundant because look, now you're just stuck in here forever. Oh wait. Nope, oh, yeah, you are. You have to go in the other way anyways. Why would they even have two? Why would they even have two different entrances? They're just gonna do it. The red ore sells for 75. Wow. I'd buy that for a dollar. Speaking of, let's... Because we don't know when the next teleporter is gonna be. We got increase your jet engine speed, release midair to cool down. Ooh, wow. And then this one you need a blueprint. I bet you it lets you fly forever.
Excuse me. When you first take lethal damage, instead regain full HP. What? What? There's a fairy mode. Holy crap. Can I afford the armor? Yo. Full moon armor. When standing in front of the gates of hell, it won't back down. I won't back down. Oh, I won't back down. Oh, wait. I didn't, that wasn't enough. I still need the next upgrade for that. Oops. Hand me up to the gates of hell, but I won't back down. And I am. You still want me to upgrade the dang lamp? Okay, tell you what. This is the last time I'm gonna upgrade the light. Because, if you look, this cog thing right here says it prevents your life from dropping below 50%, so then we'll never have to upgrade it again. But I can't afford that yet, so we'll have to wait. <laughs> Do I have a favorite kind of cookie? Are you eating cookies right now? And contemplating cookie philosophy? Um, favorite kind of cookie. I know it's kind of a, a junky answer, but Oreos are pretty damn good, but they're, they're very much their own thing. Oreos are like hardly even cookies if you really think about it. Whoa. The infection spreads. I don't know, I like a lot of cookies. You got your homemade. Homemade cookies are pretty good, like of any kind. Chocolate chip, macadamia. Peanut butter cookie. One cookie. You're being forced to see cookies that are you're shipping out to relatives. Oh, that's nice. What kind of cookies are you shipping out? You have a favorite ice cream? Ooh, that's a tough one too. I like ice cream a lot. Ice cream. I love milkshakes and ice creams. Um. Best cookies are Girl Scouts. Which which ones the? There's a lot of different Girl Scout cookies. Thin mint's the most popular one, I think. Right? There's thin mint. There's peanut butter. Samoa. All of them. I like I like ice creams with like vanilla as the base and then there's other stuff mixed into it. I feel like vanilla is like a really good base for other things. Like if you're throwing in like peanut butter cups, or if you're throwing in, like, I like, like, toffee candy inside of it, sometimes. Ah, uh, if I upgraded my bomb, it would have reached. I knew I should have upgraded it. I told you, but I have a believe me. Everyone said, eh, crazy. No one needs that upgrade. Yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. At least it doesn't melt the minerals. These ones are peanut butter cookies. Don't typically make them for festivities since my cousin has a peanut allergy. Oh. Has your cousin done something to anger your family this year? <laughs> and here's the peanut butter cookies. And if any of you don't eat them, then that means you hate us. And you must film footage of you eating all of the peanut butter cookies every family member, or you will be will be written off, will be exiled from the facsimile family. Yeah, that's your, that's your alibi, huh? That's where you're gonna tell the judge. 
see, Your Honor, uh, these were not meant to go to the victim. This was intended for other relatives. Yeah, yeah, that's what I meant. Other relatives. Uh-oh. Also, I just remembered I have this, too. <laughs> <laughs> give them all to him. Just boxes upon boxes of like these cookies showing up. <laughs> that would be like such a That'd be such like a dark mafia message. Shadow is an agent of chaos. Like your grandma in California, you should go visit her and say I sent you for cookies. <laughs> Yeah, Fax said that I could have some cookies here. Fax said that you were holding some cookies for me. Good idea. A Jimmy T. Oh, uh, yeah, I don't know where, but sometimes it just happens. You know, once in a while, you just have like a video game sound effect just pops into your head. It's just, just like you got it. Like nine volt always does. I miss the original Wario where, like, the voice, the voices, oh my god, that's my first time getting crushed by a rock, and all I had to do was stand there, I'm an idiot. Um, the voices in the original uh, Wario were so good, because they have, like, this weird, like, compressed quality to them. It's, like, uncanny, but it's perfect. Ah oh, man, we we were kind of far down. Uh. Okay, it seems like we've opened up a lot of holes, though. Did we just go in there? No, we weren't in a cave because if we were in a cave. We would have just got checkpointed, so shouldn't have been in there. Even though the cave isn't checked off, which means we missed something. Maybe we were in the cave. Maybe it just led somewhere. It... I don't know. I can't. No, I guess it did lead. Yeah. See, sometimes the caves don't lead to sub areas. They lead. Wait, what? Uh, was that me dying? Okay. No, I did do this. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, we were, we did do this game. I just, I, just, I must have missed a secret somewhere. Oh well. Do I mean the original as a GameCube or GBA? Both. They, they both have the same sound clips that are like weirdly compressed. The only difference of the. I don't even know necessarily that they're literally compressed. It might just be like there's a filter on it that makes... I'm, I'm sure in the GBA's case, there's some compression. But the only... Uh, I think the GameCube version, the visual... Like, there's, there's more visual resolution. I think that's the main difference. Aside from, like, the added party modes. Actually, the cutscenes, too. All the cool cutscenes from the GBA version aren't in the... GameCube version for some reason. Really lame. I think they were trying to sell the GameCube version as like with a real focus on the multiplayer stuff, but like Okay, but why would you remove stuff that's already in there? Yeah, that probably is why they had to compress it. That's true. That's right, because it doesn't even really have an audio card, like a proper audio like Yeah, I, I remember us talking about that one time, how the game, the GBA doesn't even, it's not a real audio card. 
It's like... Something going on in there. It's also funny how, like, the DS has lower resolution than... The DS has lower resolution than the N64. Like, that's also insane. Oh, jeez. Hog. Uh, where the heck did you come from? This place is just chaos. The cave. How close are we getting? Jeez, it's still so far down. Holy crap. I need to get a move on. At least I think the other one's closer to a point we could get to. Maybe I should have explored this area more in depth. I almost want to just start skipping these, these cave areas because I don't- I honestly don't need any more cogs at this point. The only thing is like, I like finding those artifacts. Oh, it does have a sound chip in it, but it's only for GBGBC backwards compatibility. Some games use it to really cool effect like Battle Network. Oh, okay. Did you ever end up getting that that Battle Network collection, or were you? I forgot. Were you like hesitating to get that for some? There was something about it, I think, that maybe I'll wait. Sure, it has something to do with Capcom shenanigans. Way too expensive at MSO, gotcha. I like dog. Better. Yeah, I like dog, too. I agree. I agree. That's not like an opinion, it's just what you like. I agree, you like dog. You like dog, me like dog. Oh, you're supposed to use those. Although, if I had upgraded my water bomb enough, I could just use my water bombs on that. Let's get re Oh, I would need one more upgrade. Oh, jeez. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, God. Oh, man. The famous. Almost a cutscene, but it's from a movie. So it's just a scene. There we go. That ought to do the trick. Yay, artifact. What is that, a bowl of fruit? No, a bowl of cereal. Giant marshmallows. Once the most important meal of the day, now the dried remains of a lost world. History will be kind to me for I intend to eat it. There's dinosaurs in there, okay. What is that a quote from? Because a lot of these are like quotes from things. Who's trying to eat history? What's happening? The old lady who swallowed a fly. Starting to de develop a sequel to the relaxed J-Stream. The cave man <laughs> J-Stream. Cave stream, yeah. Okay. That's a nice artifact to find. Alright. We, we need the hyperdrive dick so far away. Ouch. It does, I mean, like, it seems like the, it does seem like the, um, there we go. Okay, find another one. It does seem like the other Doomsday device will be a little bit faster to get to, at least. Man, this one is far. No lamp, only food. How much did that one guy want me to find again? 19. Oh, 21, wasn't it? Yeah, okay. A few more and then we'll get a new blueprint.
Oh, the bombs. Because I keep complaining they can't... They just barely don't reach. So yeah. Buster shells. Makes your pressure bombs shatter even harder rocks than before. Don't mind if I do. Oh, you can shoot pressure bombs in mid-air? What? But that would literally solve like so many things that are so hard to get. That would solve so much trouble right there. We gotta get that. Man, even just like fights will be easy. like so many things will, would be. That's almost busted. Being able to shoot the freaking bombs from midair like that's too good. Oof, things are getting harder to dig. I want to start saving. What the heck is that? I want to start saving up for a uh, pickaxe again. There's a lot of those over there, and that makes me a little concerned. Yeah, like you guys were saying before, this really is just like a really expansive version of the first game. But if I didn't play the first one, I wouldn't have, I wouldn't have known all the deep lore. Rusty, I wouldn't have any attachment to like, oh, we gotta find Rusty. What's Rusty up to? What's happening? I would just be like, who's Rusty? I don't give a dang. Platonic ideal of the bigger and better sequel. Ooh, I bet you my new bombs can reach. No, they can't. They cannot. So, I was oh, I was supposed to knock a bug up there. Okay, let's see if I can lead one over here. But if I had the air bombs, wait, do they not actually follow me? Damn it! I would have to reload the cave. I see that now. It's too late. I, I, I assumed they followed you. Now I know the dark truth of them not actually following you. Well, this area shouldn't be too hard to go through again, but... Is this another, like, it's gonna be a dead-end entrance? It actually... Oh no, yeah, that it, no, that's just the same place. We just went back up, okay. But now I know how to get that one thing. No, I don't, because none of them are over here. Hmm. Is there a way to get these guys to actually... I jump on them. Nope. See them, nope. Huh. Wow, if only I had my air bombs. Like, literally, I get a perfect example of what I was talking about. Or, like, I could just do things without... Like, so much easier. Huh. I don't understand how I would get one up there if I can't make without killing them. Then again, they wouldn't even probably destroy that anyways. Well, gosh. Golly G Willikers. Maybe there's another entrance. I know that this is up here, but... Isn't that only explodable from the other side? Eh. I don't think the lamp's gonna help us right now, unfortunately. Wait a minute, why did those guys start moving? Now something fishy is going on here.
This isn't the 60s, you can't just say that. I mean, anything's possible. You really put your mind to it? Oh well, I don't care. It's taking too long and I'm trying to get to the bottom. Man, I real I'm gonna have to start upgrading my dang pickaxe. This ain't cutting it anymore, fellas. Ow. You can't always mind what you want, but if you try sometimes. Find some Saturday. Is my jackhammer more? It's really not any faster, see? It's actually slower. Compared to. Yeah, it, it literally is slower. Fortunately. Oh crap, I was not looking and I almost got crushed. Only pickaxe. Piston arm is not mo is more for digging through like especially hard materials, which I know sounds like isn't that the whole point? Like this material is now harder than the other one, but I think they're actually two different categories because there's some things that the axe can't dig through. Sorry, the, yeah, that the pickaxe can't dig through, but there's stuff that the pickaxe is faster to dig through that the piston. Yeah. Wait, you're, wait, wait, wait. Shadow, I don't understand. You're saying lamp, please? But I, but you realize that we, you're, we are using the lamp, right? It's so funny. <laughs> People don't even... It's like me. I didn't even notice that the lamp was on or off. I'm, I'm just glad that I'm not alone. Shadow also can't tell if we're actually using the lamp or not. I mean, I do know what the difference is, it's just... It's just funny. Bye. Oh no, I need the water. That didn't work oh, oh well. Going. You can, but you like the lamp. Uh, yeah. Well, the thing is, we are using the lamp at all times. Except for when we're out of lamp oil, which we usually aren't. Rope. Bombs. Lamp oil. You want it? It's yours, my friend. As long as you have enough for Ruby. I'm sorry, Link. I can't give credit. Come back when you're a little, mm, richer. Does anyone get what I'm referencing, or do I just sound insane? Then again, if you know what I'm referencing, you might still think I'm insane. <laughs> But I can't help it, it's just so it's just one of those things, you know. You do, you get it, Shadow? You're a real one? <laughs> Why not both? Okay, los dos. It's about time to return to town and cash in. I hope I found- Oh, yep, there's a new teleporter, right? As I was hoping. 
Wait, what was that that just popped up up there? Oh, not enough space. I just saw red text for a split second in my mind's eye. Before we go into either of those caves... No, we have to, don't we? It looks like it's completely blocked off until you do something. Did they really have to do that? Really? Right when I was almost at the next... Ay, Dios mio. Have you ever actually played those games? No, I haven't. I have not, and I probably won't, because they look really, really, really not fun to play. <laughs> but the cutscenes are amazing. You're gonna get Breath of the Wild for Christmas? Nice. That was Fak's third favorite game, the decade. Yeah, we're gonna have to go through this cave. Could be fun to review for April Fools. It's possible. Hey, maybe they're not that bad. Well, you know what? They're probably better in emulator than they were on the CDI. Because the CDI, for some reason, refused to have a normal controller. It just had these, like, abominations. There was, like, three or four different, completely different shaped controllers. And all of them were abomination. One's literally, like, a television controller, which is, like, okay, that's... Yeah, <laughs> that's what this is. This is basically a DVD player that you're playing a game on right now. Yeah, yeah, I'm sure there are, I'm sure there are. Heck, there was a, an improved version of Simon's Quest, is, which we should have played, called Redacted, where they, they just fix a lot of issues. Oh, upgrade. Like, they make it so, the villagers, all the village people actually give you normal, like, good hints instead of, like, lying to you and being confusing and giving misinformation. Ramjet Vigor. Turn my jet engine into a weapon. What? No way. No way! Oh, you can dig up now! Wait, is that what they meant? Yeah, there we go. Okay, I was... To say. Did you hear about Link's Awakening DX PC port recently? I literally, I saw a tweet saying, sorry, this will be taken down from .itch.io, because I'm sure Nintendo, obviously. Uh, that's all I know about it, because I saw a tweet about it getting taken down. You can zoom out and see the whole map running at once. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, you know what? I think I did see like a little clip of that, and I didn't even realize it was talking about the same. Cool. 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 More like drool. Yeah, I'm kind of a class clown. I'm kind of a rebel. I'm a little irreverent. Of course, it got taken down, but it's out there now, so you can find it. Yeah. Dude, Nintendo taking it down just made me aware that it existed. Wait a second, I just... Hang on a second, hang on a second. I just went back in the same way I came out. So... Clearly that wasn't what I was supposed to do. Wait, there's blocks to the right of the cave entrance? When I'm in. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. I wasn't sure if I'd already been through there or not, but yeah, obviously not. This must be the secret formula with a little bit of on, a little bit of on. Keep it on the low. 
make sure that the load in there. I love I got pizza in my phone. Have to do the cave all over again, that would have sucked. Finally, I teleporter. Good, because I have a lot of stuff to drop off. Dude, fact, do you remember that crazy part where you go into the computer and those crazy possessed robots start chasing you? That part was pretty crazy. That was wild. I was like, what is happening? Yeah. This ain't even the same game no more. Oh yeah, I want to get the ability to shoot my water bombs emitter, so I need to get... Oh, I need to be level 14 for this? Damn, they don't want you to be able to... Maybe... I'll, I'll do the I'll do the the Ivan Drago. Pulls you forward whenever the jackhammer breaks through. That actually sounds like it could be. Oh yeah, we'll turn that on. Too. No, we don't we don't have to upgrade the lamp anymore. Remember, because now I have the mod that lets me. The lamp exists forever now. Look what you guys did back in a uh, sword. Planted the, these seeds into the minds of the innocent. You've spread corruption. Did I find any more artifacts since last time? Nope. Apparently not. Mosquito Minefield. Would you ever go to a place called Mosquito Minefield? to be that when you were mining a spot that had minerals in it, it would take longer than the non-spots, but now they take less hits. Oh, I wonder if it's because one of my mods. I think I have a mod that makes something take less. Probably. I don't know. There, there's so many things now, it's hard to keep track of. Ooh, meteor rock. What's your favorite part about the lamp, Shadow? I'm ready for your, your your dissertation on lamp. how to help you see all of me and walk into my mystery what on earth why are you, what are you singing like sonic the hedgehog lyrics that sounds like lyrics from a 3d sonic the hedgehog game you could see all of me walk into my mystery it's the boss fight oh shadow the hedgehog so i was i was technically right that is part of the, sh the Sonic uh, game of verse. Do it. I can't believe how spot on I was. No. I didn't even want it anyway. No. Uh oh. There's a 
robot gotta go to get some water down here. We're almost there. Finally. And it's probably still gonna be a whole section in there to like actually get to the doomsday device. Looks like a exit. I'm not gonna be able to dig. Okay. Oh man. There we go. Getting some water from these guys. Got the diversity core. Expect that to be the birdie num num seeds. Okay. Famous for turning each feeding into a party. With these rare delicacies, it's a really a seller's market. A bird in the hand is worth nothing unless somebody wants to buy it. The play on the old bird in the hand is worth two in the bush. We are real full up right now. Hopefully we. But once we go into that section where uh, we're trying to get to right now, I think we could, uh, there should be a teleporter in there. If I know anything about game design, even one little thing, then I will be correct. Oh, jeez. Now, how do I get in there is the question. Oh. The reflective armor is definitely paying off. Oh, you know what? I have enough water for a bomb here. Take that. Uh, yeah, if you had to guess how many different endings Shadow the Hedgehog has, I, I think I remember hearing before. Doesn't it have like 20 endings or something? Because there's like a good choice, bad choice, neutral choice, and then there's like a million different like forks in the road depending on which one you choose at any given point, right? Something like that. Three hundred and twenty-six. Okay, but what what constitutes as an ending though? Because I I'm pretty sure I've seen like what the the. I've seen what, like, the trail map looks like, and I don't recall seeing... Are you sure you don't mean there's that many different path- specific pathways you can pick? Oh, we're almost leveled up. But how the heck do I get down there? It's like I missed openings somewhere. It looks like I need... I need, like, acid resistance or something. Because it's right there, but I can't... I can't get to it. I'll have to check to the left. Oh, they, they just call each pathway a different specific name, I see. It's not that the ending itself is any different. been through here. Maybe this will lead to something. I'm all out of space. Not good at Am I gonna play Silk Song when it comes out? Uh, yeah, I'll probably play that first, and then maybe I'll get around to Hollow Knight. Huh, later. It is 
kind of funny that they give Shadow the Hedgehog a gun. Like, why does this guy have a gun? Zach, how would you feel if I somehow got, like, a review copy of... of, a uh, Silk Song, like, weeks in advance, and I actually, like, played it before I even, like, touched Hollow Knight? <laughs> I don't know where I'm supposed to be going. I'm gonna go back to the teleporter since it's kind of close anyways. I'm li I'm legit like being a brick wall here. Well hang on, let's, let's hear Fak's opinion first. Maybe Fak has a unique take on the whole concept. I'm gonna get this new axe. Ooh, we're maxed out. Feels like it does the digging for you, Templar pickaxe. It redefines aerodynamics to speed up the old swing. Oh, that'd be sick. Heck yeah. Let's, uh... Think. It's illegal. Now the only problem is... I'm missing something here. I don't know how the heck to get through... Wherever I need to get through. could progress is if I went through this green goop, but doesn't this hurt you? Oh, I'm an idiot. I am a huge idiot. Well, I don't know why I didn't realize. I don't know. Oh well, I figured it out at least. There it is. Oh, it's right there. We don't have to go through anything else. Cool. I thought there was going to be a whole extra section just for this. Alright, one more. Another one down, yeah. Nice to have someone to do this with, to not be on my own with. Hey, that was definitely an earthquake. Could have been a reaction to us wrecking that thing, I guess. When we find Rusty, I'm gonna have him explain all this. Don't worry, I've got your back. Rusty was like, no! Why did you take away my earthquake dampeners? Those were the only things keeping the world from falling apart. What have you done? And then you all have to take off in the rockets to escape the big wolf. Alright, so now... Oh, there will be a boss. We just need to get one more of those doomsday devices. And the next one should, I hope, I think, should be faster to get to. It looked like on the map it would be. I think because we've explored that area a bit more already. This area was like untouched basically. That's why it took us so long to get through it. Maybe if we're lucky, Sword will uh, be able to make it before we finish. Alright, so the other one is over in this direction. 
can't see from here. Yeah, that's yeah, yeah, that's not too bad, so long as we don't hit you know, like blockages. Oh, the lava, we can fly over it now. Heck yeah. That's gotta be where we gotta go. Are you interested enough in SteamWorld to check out the other games? Maybe, it depends on, because aren't the other games really different? Isn't one of them like a strategy game or something, which I'm not super into? Hey, we did it. Yep, this has got to be the right way. Gotta do something. Oh, I mean, I meant to find you. Oh. Yep, Sword Penguin. So far, there's the tower defense one, the tactics one, the city builder one, and the card RPG one. Okay, out of all of those, the only one that I actually would probably enjoy is the card RPG one. Not really into tower defense, not really into tactics. City Builder, I don't know, probably not either. What? Card game? The long is I can actually figure out how to play it. Simple card games I actually enjoy quite a bit. I used to like Yu-Gi-Oh a lot back in the day. And I actually like Hearthstone a lot. I used to play that. So if it's like on that level, it should be good. If it's like Magic the Gathering, which... I've had it explained to me a couple times and I never remember how to play it. Then we might have trouble. Pokemon? Here's the thing. I, like every other kid in the world, had Pokemon cards at a certain point in time. Nobody knew how to play it. I remember all the kids in my apartment, no one had any idea how to play it. We just collected them. There was one older kid who actually knew how to play, and he actually went to a tournament. He asked us all for our energy cards like for the tournament, because kids don't care about energy cards, they don't know how to play. And he actually came back with an actual rock badge, it was really sick. It was actually, it was like, it was like, uh, it was like a fantasy world item come to life. That's honestly how I felt when I first saw Yu-Gi-Oh cards. I saw the show first, and I really liked the show. And then I found out they had real cards, and my mind was blown. It was like the equivalent of finding out the Dragon Balls were real. It was like, excuse me? Why did I do that? I should... You were the older kid? But, um, yeah, it, out of all of those, that's probably what I would play. If I I'm gonna try one. Oh hell yeah, look how fat Yeah, we're getting close already. We had a big old drop there. I think we did the hardest one second. We got that out of the way. Cool. Might as well drop stuff off. I was hopefully gonna try to upgrade my, my jetpack at least one time. Um, oh yeah, I can't upgrade my, my gun, my bomb yet, until I level up one more time. <laughs> what the, the Joel Molnir drive? Um, we're almost there. Getting there. Oh, these guys, I remember them. They like to go boom boom. Oh, man, I wish I had my air missed already, but I do not. <laughs> At least I can do my air, uh. Almost said hockey. <laughs> At least I could do my air hook shot. I swear I heard Mario's oomph sound from Mario 64 for a second. But... Uh oh. 
Don't crush me, please. Good thing I have those mods where uh, enemies give me all kinds of stuff when they die. I think I have the, the diversity core, but then I also have one just for health, too, because that's very important. <laughs> that's helped me. Really kind of enabling me to tank any, any a hit. I'm gonna be honest. I'm gonna, hopefully I could get the air missiles before the boss fight. I'm sure this game's gonna have a boss fight like the first one did. And, um, probably gonna make it a lot easier. This guy's endless spawn. So do I. So. Well. Alright. I think that's my mod that makes people take damage when they hurt me, even though my armor negated any damage I would have taken. Kinda busted. Sorry. Plutonium. That's a little thing. Sorry. Final boss, in many quotations. Going away from the thing, huh? He tricked me. I thought we were so close, but so far away. Actually, actively going farther away. I'm sure we're gonna like zigzag back down if I had to go. Yeah, burn that block for me, bang. Oh my gosh! Ow! Imagine if that killed me. That would have sucked. So much easier to tell what's going on when you're not on your tiny phone. I, for one, would never have known. Hey, jetpack upgrade time. How did I talk to you? Veron sixty nine. Let's see here. That engine speed. Just need one more cog for that. Yo, it lasts longer and we fly faster, dude. This thing's busted at this point. The final boss is a clown. What is this, Wario Land 3? Okay, we just gotta go straight right. Let's do it. We're almost there. I do like this area a lot more because it's like, there's a potential for danger, but you're able to kind of just get, go through it more quickly, whereas the other one, Kind of just slowly digging downwards. What the heck? 
How is the boss to... Oh, there's a bunch of them. What the heck? Right? Alright. Well, this will help us level up quickly. Nice. First cave. The other one we were running into a bunch more caves too, since this is the only one we've run into yet. The Sun Armory, then we'll, we'll go ahead and go in. The catch. Oh, hang on a second. Oh, it's from the other side. Yeah, I'm trying to keep an eye more on the mini map. Oh, upgrade. I guess we really wanted to come in here. Maybe it helps us against lava or something. Ultra composite armor. New armor is pretty sweet. Now you don't have to complain about getting smashed. In the I don't think we could be completely careless, but yeah, it does look really cool. That would make it look even cooler. Flames. Wait. So what does that do? Okay, so it just reduces general damage. Okay, good. One more could you ask? That's it. Where's my relic? Oh, look at the picture of this. It looks like a, like a little face or a shield or something. Guys, oh, they're gonna make us level up. Oh, teleporting. Ooh, I have one hit and a bomb finishes the mob. That other one at. still get him? Nope. He must have went off mid teleport. Got lucky. Oh my god! He hit himself with a dummy. But hey, that means we could get the new bomb thing. Um, yeah, teleport is like right here, so might as well just do that. Well, if I can afford it, I might not be able to actually. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah, I think we both. We, it didn't seem like we got that much stuff, but it was just worth a very good amount. We were able to hold a lot. Do you like dogs? Do you like the song Dogs by Pink? Oh, it costs a thousand. I need it though, so I can get the mod that lets me shoot in midair. We almost got it. You like who let the dogs out? 
You like the song Money by Pink Floyd as well? Wow, you're a big Pink Floyd fan. Tell me more. Oh, they're back. The dummies are back. The dummies are back in town. No, oh, I need those for the money. These three hits. My mighty pickaxe. Does the trick. Three hits with my mighty pickaxe. Does the trick. I dig so fast now. I'm powerful for them. Don't know. Oh my god, well. I went flying. Sure, getting a lot of unobtainium despite the name. Dog equal cool. Hey, another teleporter. Alright, I think, I think, yeah, we're pretty much there, and I should be able to afford it now. Oh yeah. It is your boy, young upgrade. Wait, why do I keep going to you? I mean, you're nice and all, but... Go. Odd time. Free for this. the lava resistant for now because I haven't really been falling into it too much. And uh hell yes. Gosh. The power. Right, the guy who you could buy cogs from. I, I don't think I would have had enough coins anyways, but yeah that that's that's good to remember. This one's only 25. Really? I thought it was like 100. But I'm sure. Maybe at the time 25 felt like a lot, so now my brain is like trying to estimate what a lot feels like for one hog. We've made it. Oh, well, there it is. It's the last device. But my last device. Ooh, that's the last one. Whoa, that was a big one. This doesn't make any sense. I thought we'd be rid of the earthquakes now. Yeah, I'm sure that was the last of these devices. I've got a bad feeling about this. There are too many unanswered questions. Doomsday cults and toxic jungles? And where is Rusty? Where is Fishy? Maybe it's not Rusty. Maybe Rosie's wrong. Or she's not telling us everything. We need to go back to the Oasis talk with Rosie. Whoa, we got 2,500 XP. Yeah. Alright, are we ready for the final boss? Dude, the rocket lasts so long now, it's sick. Oh wait, the teleport is right over.
little bit of a gauntlet and then the boss. What's stopping you? Come in. That's strange. The tube back to the oasis isn't working. Fisher and Fisher, maybe the opening on that side's clogged. We'll have to dig the last stretch to get back there. What the heck? Well, that's fine because we could literally just go through this door over here. Uh, all right. I saw an X on the door and I thought that meant that it was blocked off from there too, but I would hope not. Nope. Looks open. Hey Mike, what's up? Everything... Wait a minute. Are there bombs planted all over? Do you see that? It wasn't there before, was it? Was it that crazy old lady with all the bombs? Who planted these bombs? Was it the crazy bomb lady? The entrance is blocked. Yeah, you think the earthquakes did this? We need to find another way in there and talk to Rosie. There's a lot of pipes around here. Maybe we could get in through the drains. I have a suspicious feeling that we'll find the other end of these pipes in the underground jungle. Okay, well it looks like I'm pretty much there already, at least, so... Oh, we accidentally like found where that guy came in through the pipes, remember? Already. So that's gonna work to our advantage. Those bombs have always been there? Uh, well. They're supposed to be like oil lamps, I see. Moonshine oil lamp. Luckily, we're already almost essentially made it there, but I can't dig up to that. Oh, I can shoot the bombs in midair now. Yes. Oh, this is just a godlike feeling, like you should not be able to have so much power. Now there's no point to having the one that lets you shoot them that far, really. Oh wait, I still need water. exact opening is. That's the draw of the metroidvania, the sublime power curve. I mean, I get the concept. I think there's more games than metroidvanias that do that, where, you know, you get really powered up by the end. some water up there at least. It's a defining characteristic of the metro. Man. Man. I don't know where the opening is. That kind of sucks. I have no idea which direction I need to be approaching this from. So this is... This might still take a little while to figure out. Maybe from under... Underneath. Can't go any farther in this trip. Oh, this is digable. 
Oh, hang on, this is promising. Uh... Yes, yes, here we go. Yes, this is right. Yep, this, this, this is it. We did it. Figured it out. Yes, from the pipe, break it open, go in. Sludge River Bend. Okay. Right. Oh, hang on. For all the lamp fans out there. Oh, wait, how do I get... Oh, from below. Oh, you're in Chicago, Mike, really? That's cool, what are you in Chicago for? Don't mind me asking. And we getting a lot of Imaginite now. Did you see the bean? No. What do you mean, bean? Was there like a, a magical bean? Or I saw the freaking huge bombs. Oh, the bean in Chicago, that bean. I thought you were talking about in the game. Like I no, I, I missed the bean. I didn't see it. I'm sure Dragnix would have known exactly what you were talking about immediately. Confusion. Missiles make me too OP. Oh. Oh, jeez. Maybe not. Might keep trying that. How would you... How would you fling it this way? Oh, you can hookshot them. I don't know why I forgot that. I, it, it's The game has gone to that point where there's one too many mechanics and my, my brain ram is like forgetting one of them at a time now. Yeah, I know. I did use it before without thinking, but that's just... That's, that's my brain. By the way, we got the cog. That bad feeling I got is still hanging around. Something's definitely not right. Rosie's got a lot of explaining to do once we get back to the Oasis. I should have been more suspicious. Before. If you're more suspicious, then I'd probably still be alone in the temple. Now let's get out of the drain and see. I don't know why they're suddenly suspicious of Rosie. I wouldn't jump to that conclusion. everybody where's everyone gone hmm, this is creeping me out we have to find Rosie and see what she's been up to keep out Rosie she's got to be in here huh Rosie's storage 
Oh, nope, it wants me to leave. <laughs> Never mind. Oh, this is new, apparently. This thing's looking really ominous when it's open. Are you sure we need to go in there? Yes. Okay, let's see what that big shiner's got cooking in there. It seemed like a point of no return moment, didn't it? And again, it kind of asked you that as well before going into the computer earlier. Whoa, uh-oh. We don't want to grab all of those. I think we want to save those. Boss Arena? Mega Man? Rusty? No way. Dot? Oh! He's like powering a mech with Rusty. There he is. You really shouldn't have come back here. What are you doing? Let him go, Rosie. You know how many shiners were hurt capturing him? He's a monster. Now he's just a battery in my mech suit, and I'm finally strong enough to keep your kind out. You lied to me. I used you. You're a tool, and I needed someone to disable those pesky devices. He built them to draw the power from the fusion distillery, but no more. Well, I was exactly right. This reactor will give me what I need to control my kin. An endless supply of moon juice? What? They will have no reason to wander off. They will stay safe and show me the respect I deserve. She just wants to, to create a, a perpetual amount of moon juice. So this is what you meant when you said shiners were deranged and dangerous. The earthquakes, the reactor's unstable Vectron tech. No, you're unstable. I'm finally in control. You're insane. Enough of this. Uh-oh. Is a sh Oh. Angie. Oh, that worked. Let him go! Rusty didn't do anything. Uh-oh. Oh, jeez. Holy crap. It's like if a machine gun had spread shot somehow. Oh look, it's that one guy. He's here too. Good, we're good, we're good. Good, oh! Is somebody doing something? Oh, there it is. Okay, I was waiting for that. Yeah, but they were deranged golem shiners. Oh, jeez. Now they're like pinballs flying all over the place. It's like a crazy multi-ball mode. Oh jeez. Oh no! Oh jeez. Indicated by a death skull in the corner. Hey, these guys, when they die, I get health. Good. Big one, there we go. Fast forward. Oh, I bet you could hit it from the top. I thought you had to hit where Rusty was specifically, but I, I bet you that's not the only spot. Ouch. Can't believe Rosie evil this whole time. Well, here's the thing. Don't the Shiners attack you on sight? So it is their, their fault. We were just self-defending. And these ones didn't attack on sight, which is why we assumed they were all fine. I guess the other ones were, but Rosie was up to no good. 
And I, I won't even... Oh, jeez. Screwed up. I didn't know she was firing that. I'm gonna have to try to run it into her manually. It didn't work. <laughs> it didn't work. There we go. Okay, one more go. It's true that I attacked the first Shiner I saw in this game. But that was an honest mistake. Where you see... They were, they were coming right at me. They had a big old moonshine in their eye. They had that boom boom in their eye, you know? Ouch. Ouch. Oh god, this is bad. Good thing there's health everywhere. Oh crap, the missile. Ah, it was just too, a little too low. I missed. Here we go. There we go. This is it. Yes. That boom boom pow. Yeah. Rusty. The reactor is going to blow. The quakes will destroy everything. We must get out of here. Scrap that. We'll make it out together. Hey, this thing is going haywire. Let's get out of here now. Professor Sherman's rocket. We need to get back up to town now. Oh, it's like a carrying cutscene. RE6 all over again. Except I do have to aim myself. You don't just hold one button down to go. Okay, good. <laughs> that was convenient. We were almost screwed. Let's just go into virtual reality for the rest of our lives. Come on, Fen, we have to hurry. There's no way we'll make it back to the city like this. But I could get the two of you out in time. Uh oh, Fen's actually gonna sacrifice? No way I'm not leaving you down here. Can't go through this thing with us. No time to argue, there's no other way you two get in here. Ow. Fen, I'll come back for you. I know you will. Now go. So then... First game, Rusty supposedly sacrificed and dies. See you around, Dot. In this game, it's Fen. So that means in the third game, we're gonna look for Fen. We're gonna play as presumably the mayor, Yonker. He seems like pretty admirable. Oh, it's that one guy. It's those other guys. God, get out of the way, mayors and child bots first. Sorry, I'm going as fast as I can. Calm down, folks, one at a time. Form an orderly line, you hear? Hey, we ain't got time for lines. Just get under the rock before this whole place collapses on us. Hold your jaw, son. We've still got bots down in the darn mine. We can't just leave folk behind. Sir Heisenberg is ready to ignite the rocket, but I can hold the launch off for a minute or two. Then we have to blast off. Beep boop. Bar globe. <laughs> Yeah, you said it, Mr. Barnacle. What? I ain't said nothing. Oh, oh I thought we were gonna have to do another chase thing for a second. Um, what in tarnation? There you are, dearie. Thank goodness you're safe. Good show. I was worried that you would got yourself lost. I see you found that red scarfed miner, but where's that glowing little friend of yours? It, it's a long story, I have to. Well, I'm happy to see you're safe and sound, but I must stress we really are out of time. Everyone aboard the rocket. Time for some Steambot space adventures, yeehaw. Wow. So I kind of saw this coming, they, they foreshadowed this. Oh, sudden credits, okay. Look, it's going art. The cultists are happy that they're leaving. See ya!
Is this a credit, like, page? Like a single page? Like it's the whole credit? Okay. Oh, for a second. Linger on there for a while. Well, the world exploded. But yeah, they foreshadow that, oh, there's rockets just like these all over the world. And it's like, oh, okay, the world's gonna explode. <laughs> Right, the cultists did want this. It was all Rosie's fault. She went mad with moonshine. Too bad. This is so sad. Wow. Step one, rebuild civilization. Step two, find Fen. Fen's gotta be out there somewhere. El Huervo! Did the music along with Pele and the Rubri. Um. Wow. Oh, the title screen looks a little different now. <laughs> Together, we're not alone. We did it. Rosie just wanted her Mountain Dew. Uh, well, hey, I'm pretty happy we were able to finish this in two streams. We did, they were pretty long streams, but very efficient. Um, yeah, I do think that this one was an improvement over the first one, I agree. It didn't feel like it was too long either. It was like a pretty good sized game for me. Like it didn't just feel like it dragged on and on. Steamworld Heist actually came out before Dig 2, so the world exploding was kind of a given as that game takes place in space. Oh, it takes place after 2, but it came out first. It, was that just a coincidence? Like they were working on it at the same time or something? Noise acting, that's, that's good. Because sometimes his voice acting is just like grunts and stuff, right? Avoidable. Roboto translation. We did it. We beat the world. We exploded it. Oh, you can go quick. Full time. Sheriffs? Oh, that must be like a like a Kickstarter tier, a Patreon tier or something. Uh, office dogs, look, the dogs. Shadow. Caesar, Cora, Izzy, Kaiser, and Andro. Don't you wanna like be on a dev team just so you could put your pet in the credits. Thanks for playing. For support or any questions, tweet us at imageform. Visit imageform.s. I mean, they were probably working on them simultaneously, but they're separated by more than a year, so I think Heist was intended to come out. Um. Well, we did pretty decent on deaths, wealths, and secrets, but apparently we actually took a little long because we only got a bronze on the time. I wonder if you're under eight hours if it's silver, so we just barely got the bronze. But that just means if we didn't spend more time on the secrets, we would have probably gotten a faster time, and that's fine because I like that we were able to look at a decent number of artifacts. Those are fun. I like I like little collectibles in games where it's like you get a look at it and then you get a read of like a little description. Those are always fun. Like in Pikmin or like Wario. But um Alright, we did it. We beat it. Oh, I could have turned off pause on last focus. We did it. Um Well, that means that we are free up for the rest of the month, so I need, I'll, I'll have to figure out what I'm going to play next. And, you know, hopefully we, we can end on some strong... We've already done... I loved Everhood. 
the steamroll games are pretty fun you know um well i guess we'll just have to see what's next won't we just a few more games to hit the hundred game mark it, it, it could happen if they're if they're smaller games it's possible but all right i'm gonna wrap up now thanks everyone for joining hope you have a great weekend i'll catch you later